قل هذه سبيلي أدعو إلى الله Sami from the U.S. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum wa rahmatullah. So I know that for someone who has gas incontinence, they make wudu for every adhan. But um, my question is, uh, when can I take the dispensations of someone with gas incontinence? Like if I make my wudu and I'm certain that I broke it, and I make a second one, and then again I'm certain, do I make a third one? How, for how many will those do I say I have gas incontinence? So if a person is doubtful whether he has gas incontinence or not, he's one of two. Again, either he's a person that knows through previous experiences that once, it's, once it pops, it never stops. So it keeps on going on on very close intervals that would not be logical for him to make wudu. In this case, make one wudu and pray, even if you break your wudu, because you know from experience that it's not going to stop. Or you know from experience that this would take 15 to 20 minutes or half an hour because of something you ate, because of your habits, I don't know how or why, but you know that it's going to continue for half an hour and then it stops for another half an hour or an hour. If you know this, then it's prohibited for you to pray during this first half an hour. You have to wait. And until it stops, then you make a wudu and pray fresh without having any problem. What if I'm in between? I'm hesitant. I'm not sure. In this case, I would think that delaying your prayer until almost the end of time when you feel that it's not going to stop and the time is going to expire in this case you make wudu and pray without a problem and Allah knows best And have you ever taken a, a counseling session with me? Go to my website and you will find counseling sessions and apply for one. If you can afford it, <laughs> that's good for you. If you cannot, you're entitled for one free session. And this is for everybody. If they can uh, uh, um, affirm by Allah that they cannot afford it because they're poor, I'll give them one free session without a problem, a full half an hour. So come to me and let's speak about it, inshallah, within the following two days or three days. And bi'ithnillah azza wa jal, I will uh, 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 try and seek Allah's guidance to solve your problem once and for all bi'ithnillah.